children are in danger. They are fully in danger. So the whole school, the whole buildings are even destroyed. The ceiling, there is no. You cannot even. It is not. You cannot talk about it. It is those that come to see it that we know that this school is not even in a good uh, condition. So we are begging the government to come to our aid. I am John Ojo, the Odon way of this community, Okmoha. Okmoha community, a very south west. Uh, you see, right from time, this school, this school, in fact, it was founded in 1955. Since then, they've been renovating other schools, government to uh, maybe uh, local, local government or even uh, to state government. But this is our school. It's just there like that. We, we can't get luck, say the school is not closed. People are still attending it, but it makes very many people to sky away. I don't understand. Okay, like this uh, school here now, it's serving three communities. Okmoa one, Okmoa two, then Okmoa uh, Benny Corner. I was brought up in Okmoa village. Uh, this school was uh, this school was founded 1955. Since that time to today, now this school is not found. And the way when I take build the school since that time, and this school we now from this school, I myself from uh, 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 out from from my sis. Now there are other uh, small small uh, villages inside here. I don't understand. So we are begging the government, make them try because the school is collapsing. People are seeing how the school be now. It's along the road, not be school way there inside bush. You know they inside bush. People they see who they go be nigo, see who they go who uh, who they go okada. They they see here very very awkward. This condition of the school is very bad. This condition of the school very bad. And uh, if the, the parents of the, uh, the, the people come to the school now, they will never like it. And most particularly as you don't begin to break, who they fear because of uh, anything can happen. I pray God made that kind of bad thing not happen to our children. Uh, the school is almost destroying. You can see the buildings are no more a building. So the community have tried, we have moved. To various agencies and various uh, governments to give to make sure that this school is being built, but to date, nothing came out from them. And at the time, we went to Suburb, we went to the local government council. And we, the indigenous, we don't want the school to collapse. We have been donating money. The parents of this of the students, we have been donating money to renovate, to do some other thing to make the school to be in a good uh, condition. But we have been trying our best. We want government to come to our aid to answer our cry because we have population. But due to the condition, people have got injury. People have got many, many things, casualties. That's why they take their children to the other school, to private schools. We don't have other schools here except this. This is a, a place whereby the people share Two class, one, uh, one classroom for two classes. Like uh, the, the class we are now is uh, primary four and five. Imagine the, you can see the uh, blackboard whereby primary five views uh, this side primary four. So it's very odd because if you see the way the school is now, uh, nobody will allow the children to enter this, the the, uh, the, uh, the classroom. Bring uh, three, three children come here. The, my last born is about uh, three years old. He gets injury from this school during April this year. That make me to carry that small one come up for here. The two are still here now. I have uh, five children in this school. I have the condition of the school. I don't like it at all. Why? Because this school is, is my community. If not, it's supposed to another place. I for remove my, uh, my, my children away from the school. And we also are aware that uh, the government has put this, play, uh, this school in a budget. And in 2017, 
they, they, it was uh, in the budget, and they reversed it again to 2018. They seen in the budget. And let the government give us the new school. Why? Because the teachers are here. The, the, the pupils are here. So we, we don't really know what is happening. If the government is using us as a tool, or so the followers are using us as a tool. This community is an ancient community. This school was founded in 1955. It is there we all attended. So we can, you can see the, uh, the school is not, uh, it's not encouraging for learning. I beg government, may they try to, to help us in renovating this uh, our primary school. So we are begging the government, uh, the, the governor to please come to our aid, the governor of Edo State, to, to, which is uh, the commissioners and the everybody to, that are aware that they should come to our aid so that they can, this school can be built. So the, our children are in danger, they are fully in danger. So the whole school, the whole buildings are even destroyed. The ceiling, there is no, you, know, you cannot even, it is not, uh, you cannot talk about it. It is those that come to see it that we know that this school is not even in a good uh, condition. So we are begging the government to come to our aid. My children have been attending this school for a long time and the school is still existing. Now, we shouldn't know the reason why they should say this school, this school has been uh, closed down. I don't know those people who are saying that. that. This school is still existing and we are still on it. Children are still in this school. So, I am pleading to the federal government to come and renovate this school because this school is not closed. So this school, we want to say make it, make the call repair this school because this school is not good for the children at all. Now make uh, uh, my grandchildren, about six of them, seven, as I look the school, now take the go new road. Now take the, the go school because of this uh, school. Only two class day. So now the other children, they pack, they enter. So I not go, he, he, my self not go like her. So I want to say make it this they go do this school, make it better for we. We bring all our children for here. They go go school. We serve the work for farmer. So that expense is too much for me. So make the do make the the school develop. Make we we call the happy for ourselves. I beg, we beg government. Make the God do it for us.
and named Antino Demigier. This school was founded 1955. So now the school is collapsing. Even some of uh, uh, the local government chairman, they came here, we give them the same promises they will do the school for us. They cannot be able to do it. Even commissioner from Benin also come here. We gave the gift. No one will be able to do the, the school for us. Please, we don't know how to the school as we call us in. The children, they are coming here. Rainy side, when it is rainy, they cannot go to the school. They, the teacher will drive them home. So we are suffering here. The children attending the school here, because of that now, they are sending them to the city. So that is the problem we are, we are, we are facing here. Since 1917, we have got our primary school. And this primary school is number 40 in the whole Nigeria. In the whole Nigeria is number 40. See, look at the primary school, no chair, the area is rough, over the community they use their money to roof whenever the thing is leaky. If you look to the class, no uh, chair, the students are sitting on the floor. The, 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 the primary school building is uh, it's, it's an ages uh, building. The, the, the building, the, the, the all crafts, they are dilapidated. Even the, 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 the pupils in that school, their lives are in, in danger. We have been crying it. They don't agree. The children are even sitting on the floor. The children today. are sitting on the floor. The, 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 the children, they will go with their school uniform to the school. Only Monday and Tuesday, their uniform will get lost because no, no better, uh, no considering uh, uh, building for them to learn. So we are using this medium to beg government.
This our school was since 1955. They have been attending it. The school collapsed. After collapsing, we cried to the government. Several times they put it in budget. When we wait for their tenor, no way for them to repair this our school. Up till now, as well as this school is, the help of the community, we the community builders this uh, one as the present one now who is now here. We are still crying to the government. They never care to listen to us. But they said they added to the budget of this uh, turnout they are now. Our peoples are suffering. These are children of tomorrow. Let us fight for them. We are begging the government to help us so that these children, they may be president of tomorrow, so that they will get a place where they will understand that the government is favoring everybody. We are citizens, and we don't know why they refuse to help this our school. We are still appealing to them to repair this our school for us, because it still has been a long time. With the community, we have tried ourselves since we built it, we did cry to them in a way and manner for them to help us. That's why we cry to them still more and more for them to remember, not to forget. I beg, government, help us. I beg, make one help us. Our primary school, Obia Primary School, Bo, is being destroyed. There's a certain time here when rain was falling. The roof, that is uh, the, the ceiling, collapsed and wound about seven children, about 35, uh, 35 children in primary one, 35 children also in primary two. Among them, they get wound. The, the old children now, their, fam, their parents they have taken them away to other place to, to go for school. Of your primary school, Ugbo, is collapsed. And there's a time the ceiling fell down, wound about uh, seven boys. We take off them, nobody help us. We shot, nobody help us. So now we are begging government. We are begging government to come and come to our aid. The school is dying. Some children they are running away. The parents say they cannot leave their children to come to this school again. But some people are some children are still bearing it with their parents. So we beg government to come and help us to, to, to build the the building so that the children can use it. We are begging because it just be like say we are inside hole. No help, nothing whatsoever. Everything just collapsed. So we are begging. We don't want this school to, to be closed. We need help that they should come and do it for us.